best team on console. Okay, right, start. Are you ready? Yeah. You ready now? Uh, we, I love the game with the best team on console, and, and I just really think it's a great, I, I just, I mean, fantastic game, way better than Blackout, and the, the marketing was just perfect for Do it. You I'd actually really appreciate it if we can get another one of these made. Very <laughs> Good morning and welcome to another episode. Today's super dope. Okay, I've been in the office for a couple of hours now. I got a. Uh, I got. A, I, look, I don't want. I'm not gonna do an unboxing uh, review, but I got a package from the Sidemen. If you guys don't know who the Sidemen is, they they are, in my opinion, uh, the best content team in the world. If you were to put content team together, uh, you know everybody's there. Like everybody, that's anybody. It's anybody in the. U I mean, the U they run the UK one thousand percent, but definitely, uh, in my opinion, all of YouTube. They they they're trendsetters. Doesn't matter. I'm not kissing their ass. I'm just giving props where props is due. Okay. Uh, anyway, so I was saying today is going to be super 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 dope because we are heading to a very special place. Haven't never I have never been there. Been here for about a year, exactly a year, almost. Like, actually, a year and like a month or so. Um, and this is the first time that I'm visiting this, uh, this incredible place. This just got put up. All for the team. This one I had the two-page editorial on Game Informer. Nice. Look at this. These are the, the Joe Lausen uh, shorts that he wore. This, this was uh, this is the shorts that he wore on, uh, on national TV. Not national. Sorry. What am I saying? On pay-per-view for everybody to see. And the Optic Gaming logo was that's the first. That was the first match. On the second match, we realized that if we... If we move the logo to the butt, to the butt area, then you'll be able to see it. So anyway, so people ended up seeing our logo for close to like 90 minutes. No, three rounds and five minutes, 15 minutes. It was a long time that they were watching our logo. Anyway, uh, let's get to where we're going. gaming haven't been here i've been here for a year but I never made it in here so i'm super psyched about it i'm wearing a hat i don't think i should have i have excellent hair i don't know why i did So Jonathan just gave me the tour of the entire Mavs uh, state. Well, what do you call it? Uh, gaming facility. The gaming facility for yeah. their NBA 2K team. It's it's insane. They have like these streamer booths and like, like I mean they did a really really good job. And it reminds me of the Hex quarters a little bit. And I'll show you why in a second. But you know this is uh, one of their streaming booths. They really they killed it. These are soundproof panels, which is super super dope. But these are the. Uh, the streamer booths, you know, so it's it's nice and cozy in here, but it's they got a they got a, an awesome setup. So you literally just come in here now. Obviously, uh, them being so NBA 2K focused and centric, they uh, they don't need as much space as uh, a PC player or something like that. So, but these streaming booths are actually legit. They got the Mavericks gaming logo in the back, Mavericks gaming logo in the back of that chair, lights, soundproof. It's actually pretty cool. Uh, anyway, I gotta I gotta head back, but it's amazing in here. I love the lighting. The thing that capt captivated me the most are these like halo LED lights. Amazing. All right, boys, be good. Thank you for the tour. Appreciate Thank you. you. Thank you. Good to see you, man. Thanks for coming through. Hi, bro. Appreciate it. See you guys later. Anyway, so super super dope. So they, like, and it goes. I think they said it was like 45,000 square feet. I, I don't need that much room. Obviously, it's just me and the hex orders and a couple of squatters. But it's amazing. I'm tempted, but I'm not going to. Necessary. Back at it again. Oh, feels good. It's, it's starting to rain, which kind of sucks because I wanted to like go fishing this weekend. But oh well. Hey. What's up, big guy? Up in here, dude. How you doing? I weighed myself this morning. A hundred. What? I weighed myself this morning. Two hundred and eleven point seven. No way. Everyone's, heaviest, heaviest I've ever been. Everyone's at their heaviest right now. It's just crazy. It's yeah. Just really crazy. I'm about to have my first workout like in thirty minutes. 
in like two weeks. I took Damn. a picture of myself in the mirror, you know, sent, yeah. it, sent it to the girl. Had no abs. Get out of here. I'm not showing. I'm not showing. No I abs. wasn't asking you to. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, so what's up? When are we hitting it? When you want to hit it. Uh, I'm down for next Monday. I was going to go today, tomorrow, Friday, rest, Saturday, Sunday, and then hopefully have a group of friends, comrades, yeah. to uh, gym ski. Yeah. You think we should put a, a bench in here? You know what I think you should ask to see if you can put in here? The TRX stuff. See if you can put anything attached to the ceiling or on the walls. To so just get get a little workout in, right? It's not in the way. Like, that's not in the way. 20-minute session, and then, and then we're done. The, f the thing about that, though, is that if we put a gym in here, and I've seen some really cool ones on, on, uh, on Instagram where, like, it's a ra like it's really cool. Anyway, I've seen this really I don't know the name of it, but it's pretty much like a, like a rack. Have you seen it, Mike? Yeah, that's pretty fit in here, right? You know what I'm talking about? The stuff at the... It's like a rack, so picture a rack, and then you can you can unload it. Yeah, I saw the ads on Instagram. Yeah, and then, on Instagram. Yeah, 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 and then they're, they're like the weights are like art pieces. Yeah, yeah. Dude, do so, that. The, the thing is this, as, as I was about to explain, if I put something like that in here, and Maddie's in here fucking hitting the weights, fucking sweating it out, I'm in here, I don't sweat. Well, maybe now that I'm fat, er. Uh, but in high school and like I never so I just, I just I just don't sweat profusely like other people do but if I was to do that and I'm thinking about it if I was to do something like that then how is my space gonna smell because to me the most important thing in any living quarters or any situation or anything any place that I'm in is the smell if the smell is anything that isn't clean it's just not for me I can't be I cannot be in there call me bougie call me uh, uh, a different call me that I'm not from Juarez and I don't give a Fudge what you call me. I don't care. I, it's all about cleanliness. If you guys get to ever step foot in here, and I'm, and I'm thinking of a cool project that I can do where people can come in, and say maybe like a museum type of thing where I, I, I have an idea, okay? I haven't, haven't told you guys, but I have an idea about the hex quarters where you guys can come visit, say hello, and, and all that jazz. But um, it's, it's going to take some time to develop. It's going to take some time for me to really sit down and itemize everything that I need to do. Um, Anyway, I'm gonna have a meeting with Maddie, a content meeting with Maddie. Gotta come up with a content strategy for Turtle Wax. I'm super excited because we're gonna do something that you guys are gonna fucking love. Uh, well, actually, I don't know if you guys will like it. I'm certainly gonna like it. Uh, anyway, it'll be good. What is this? You can speak in the vlog today. Explain your dirtiness. I don't know. Clean it, Matt. I don't like it. Oh, it's gonna be clean. I don't think that was. Don't him. say it was. Out. It was. It fucking was, was not out. I think that was probably him. No. If I had to guess. That game. That game right there has captivated the minds and the hearts of a lot of people, including Alan. And I'm talking about this game came out of nowhere. It's a battle, a free to play battle. Hold on. It's a free to play battle royale game that came out of absolutely nowhere. Uh, Respawn Entertainment, if you guys don't know who that is, is like Vince Ampel and a whole bunch of other IW employees, IW being Infinity Ward, who created uh, Call of Duty 2, Call of Duty 4, two of my top five games of all time. Uh, they separated from, from Activision Blizzard and then they went and created this thing. They created uh, two games, well, I think more than that, but the main ones that you think is Titanfall 1 and Titanfall 2. And now this. But the thing is, is that this game, last Friday, Hutch is like, yo, this new game coming out. This is a battle royale game made by the Titanfall guys. Uh, Respawned it. And I'm like, what? okay, when does it release? It's like Monday. And I'm like, okay. what? So I don't know where this game comes out. It's free to play. Although I've already spent $300 on the game since Friday. $200 on PC. $100 on, on PlayStation. It plays well on both. The crazy thing is, is that unlike, uh, unlike uh, uh, Blackout, the, the graphics aren't that much different than each other as, as they are on PC versus that. Like, yeah, it's smoother in, so, uh, in some instances, depends on the, on the power of your computer, but m m they're the same game. And, uh, you know, I love console. That's like my favorite thing to play on. Obviously, 10 years of, of hand-eye coordination, as, I said, as I've told you, have muscle memory. As I told you a million times, I'm not going to regurgitate it, but everybody loves it. Everybody loves yeah, it. Everybody's inside. Like it. And it's getting like a lot of hype. And I'm not, I'm not, I didn't get paid to say this, okay? Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. But everybody that went out and checked it out, they played it. Look, it, you, games like these don't often come out. Games like these that are this good, this smooth, like this game is already better than, than, uh, than PUBG. It's smoother it's in, in, in all that. Uh, H1, we're not even going to talk about H1 or any other battle royale that's out there, okay? Uh, but it's that good. If you, like, Hitch is over there playing it, has been playing it with, the, with his team this entire time. Um, but yeah, it's crazy how good this game is. 
and it came out of absolutely nowhere. He's, he's in the middle of the game right now, but as soon as he's done playing it, I'm actually going to go ask him uh, what he thinks of the game right now. Because I'm going to rate it like uh, 8.5 out of 10. Uh, there's still a little bit. I, I don't even care. That's 8.5 because the things that I don't like about it aren't that big of a deal. So 8.5, solid 8.5. Uh, Vinny Z and, and all you guys at, at uh, Respawn Entertainment, god damn it, you guys killed it. And I mean it. Okay, I'm a literal hater and hate everything that isn't normal or isn't a part of my normal every day. I hate change, is what I'm saying. And this thing, amazing. Best team on console. Okay, right, start. Are you ready? Yeah. You ready now? Uh, we, I love the game with the best team on console, and, and I just really think it's a great, I, I just, I mean, fantastic game, way better than Blackout, and the, the marketing was just perfect for Do it. Do you think it was way better than Blackout? Nah, I mean, it's just different. I'm having a fun time it, with it. It is though. different. Um, have you. I mean, you needed a break, right? November, so you, you guys have been playing the Blackout since? Yeah, we played a lot of Blackout, then we played a little bit of GBs, then found out GBs kind of suck, so then we played Blackout, and then now we're playing uh, uh, this game. One, uh, best out of ten. I mean, one out of ten. Rate it. I'd give it like an, like an eight and a half. Like a Damn, nine, really? Like a nine, yeah, yeah. Just, to, just how, how, how it was like marketed and stuff. Just, how was it marketed? It wasn't. Good point. See, that's, that's, that's exactly what I mean. Out of nowhere, they immediately came out and they just dropped this game. Anyway, uh, my game's about to start, so I'm going to end the vlog right here. Everybody, thank you for tuning in. I'm not addicted, I promise. I just like it really much. Uh, thank you for tuning in. If you guys enjoyed the video, please remember to leave. With that, leave a like, having said that, with that, I'll see you guys tomorrow as usual. And it's for you, so the same. Damn.